everybody, and welcome back to my world. My name's Ellie, but you can call me Els. Boo! And we are continuing, and we need to introduce ourselves to that lady, said person. She gonna be so nice. All these people, all these folks around here are just so lovely. I like them all. I'm done being nice. Oh, shit. If you don't hand Ringo over soon, I'm going to get my friends and we're burning this town to the ground. Got it? We'll keep that in mind. Now, if you're not going to buy something, get out. He seems quite angry. Come back. Come back, angry person. If you wanted, you could actually follow him uh, and take his side on things, but I tend to not want to do that because he's a dick. So, la la. Hi, Trudy. Well, you've been causing quite a stir. Glad I finally got to meet you. Welcome to the Prospector Saloon. Thanks, Bay. Show me what you have for sale. Is there anything I can sell you? We collected quite a lot of things back there, so we want to get rid of some of the baby Give me a shout if you need anything else. Oh, is that all about? Our little town got itself dragged in the middle of something we don't want anything to do with. Uh oh. About a week ago, this trader, Ringo, comes into town. Survivor of an attack, he says. Bad men after him. Needs a place to hide. Can't have a go at him. He's got an awesome name. Shock. So we gave him a place to lie low. We didn't actually expect anyone to come after him. Where is he? He's holed up at the abandoned gas station up the hill. Let's kill him. That's not our way. Blah blah. blah. What are you gonna do? Others like Sunny will probably stand up for. Personally, I hope he sneaks up. Powder gangers. Chain gangs, really. God damn them. The NCR brought them in from California to work on the rail lines. Problem is, it turns out that giving convicts a bunch of dynamite and blasting powder isn't the best idea. Yeah, not really. Big escape not too long ago. Some of them stuck together so they could make trouble. That's what we're dealing with now. You poor sods. Right, go away. I don't want to listen to all of your talking. It is very interesting, but I don't want to listen to to be doing a quick run through here. But um Oh, I don't care. Let's just do it properly. Let's just do it properly. We're doing it as a celebration for Fallout 4. We might as well just do whatever the hell. So if I happen to go into some side quests, then it happens to happen. But if I don't go into some side quests, then it doesn't matter either. Because these kind of games are great to discover for yourself. They're great. Great fun. Sunset, see, it's Barilla. Oh yeah, I'll take all of that. With the comprehension perk, you gain more. Oh, well, I was interested in reading that, but never mind. That's close enough. Who are you, and what do you want with me? What beautiful chiseled features! I'm not an enemy, if that's what you're asking. Sorry about the gun. You just caught me off guard. That's all. We got off to a bad start. What say we start over with a friendly game of caravan? You know how to play? Oh my god, I don't want to play a friendly game of caravan. I've never played a friendly game of caravan. Yeah. He doesn't look very tough, though. I hear he's afraid I'll shoot him down from one of the windows when I see him. And he's right. La, la, la. I'll have a much bigger problem once his friends show up. There's no way I could handle all of them in a gunfight. Mmm, that would be a bit hard. But um, Oh, so many innuendos. I'm not going to comment gonna in case the kids are watching. As as I can, assuming the town doesn't throw me to the wolves. I've got no chance against the gang on my own. Maybe I can help. We'd just end up sharing the same grave if it's just the two of us. Don't you worry. I'll see who I can round up. I'll stop with Sunny Smiles because she's amazing. And everybody fancies Sunny. Ooh, there's a floor safe. Okay, I used to be quite good at these. So I um, said I used to be quite good at them. It doesn't mean I still am. There we go. Ta-da! Take... Take, 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 take. Let's take it all! And then start worrying once we've got too much stuff. Take it all. Take it all! A crate of cigarettes. <laughs> Open the crate and you shall have some sunset sarsaparilla. Nothing mm, over here. What are we doing? How are we doing for... A weight. Okay, so we've got 180 out of 100, 210. We've got 30 spaces left for things, and I'm sure we could sell some other stuff off and eat some of the rest. It'll be fine. Don't you guys worry. Don't you worry, little socks. He's off. It's gonna be fine. <laughs> I'm yawning and I'm not even tired. 
<laughs> Ooh, I missed the mailbox. There's always ah, oh, there's usually stuff in the mailboxes. <laughs> it has failed me. Look, I've discovered a thingy. Great, a drop box which I never use. One day, one day it shall be used. One day. Doggy, let me stop the little doggy. Howdy. Sunny, need your help. Beautiful. Look at her. She is radiating light still. Hi there. I'm Sticking taller than her. For a while longer. Now this is new for me because I'm usually shorter than everybody else. Say no more. I'm in. Oh well, that was it. <laughs> Joe Cobb talks about leaving us alone if we hand over Ringo, but I know his type. He and his friends will come after the town eventually. However, between you, me, and Ringo, we aren't exactly a force to be reckoned with. A lot of people around here look up to Trudy. If you could convince Trudy to join us. Some of the folks in town might decide to help out as well. I know Easy Pete's got a stock of dynamite somewhere. And Chet just got a shipment of leather armor we could borrow. Talk to them as well. Okay, okay. Finally, there's a good chance we'll all end up with extra... Doc Mitch, blah de blah Yep. Cool. Any ideas? A silver tongue would help. Well, that means that you have to have a really, really good kissing ability. La 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 la. Not really. It means that you have to be good at speaking to people. Hey. Hello, Trudy. How you doing? So you're planning on taking on Joe Cobb's gang. It's a big risk, but I suppose you have to do what you think is right. Come help us! I was Yay! This one out, but for some reason, I can't help but like you. I'm with you. It's because we're Let awesome. Word with a few other folks, and we right? have um, well, olive done skill. Gun, and we are beautiful. We stand to be a little better equipped. And we have beautiful figure. And we are Hispanic. I always wanted to be Hispanic. Feeling thirsty? Yay, I will look at your broken radio. Because there is always time to help the radio. Ta-da! Now I've got... Feeling thirsty? I broke... I fixed your radio. Yeah, I heard it. Woo! That's it. Give me more! How much is normally charged for this sort Now. See what I mean? It's always useful to up the important things like barter and speech. And pretty much everything is really important. But I like to focus on ones that will get us through things quite quickly. Pete, you require explosives. I don't think I have explosives. Howdy. Too dangerous. God damn it. Never mind. Never mind. I'm never going to convince him with explosives. And I'm not going to waste my time attempting to up that. So... Let's get on with something else. God, my sentences. Oh, you must be the one Doc <clears throat> Mitchell was patching up. The way I heard it, I didn't think you'd be walking out of that office. Well, I did. I've got plenty of supplies for sale. Thanks, Bay. You got some weapon mods. And awesome. Show me. I need to felt, help fight now the just powder hold gangers. On. I never voted to take on the powder gangers. That's a thousand cap investment you're talking about. I don't think so. You may Give me your stuff. I can provide people with some leather armor and extra ammo. Sure hope it's worth it. And uh, I'll be guarding the store while all this is going on. You coward! My business first. You understand? No, I don't understand. You are a coward, and I don't forgive you. Goodbye. Oh, what a useless piece of poop! I don't appreciate cowards. They're rubbish. Oh my God! Who are you? Sorry, I tricked you, but thanks for clearing out the geckos. Now I can get to that stash up there. Well, you're a bit delayed. Come at me, bro. Come at me. Well, yeah, you you were ages ago. You were ages. You you could have. Yeah. Give me your stuff. He lied to me. He lied to me. Oh my god, I have way too much stuff in my pockets. Never mind. We'll sort it out later. No, we'll sort it out. No, we'll sort it out later. I comment on the beauty of things a lot. Welcome back. I had hope you wouldn't need to come see me again, so I'm hurt. I need help. No, I need medical supplies. Gimme. Sure. No, not that kind of... I mean, bleh. Seems like wherever I... Oh, I'm not much good in a fight with my bum leg. And my... Thank you, Doc. Don't you worry. Goodbye. He has a music stand, but I see no instruments. Maybe he's a singer. I can imagine him doing that. A country western singer. A country western singer. Doc Mitchell. A country western singer. It would be amaze balls. Right, going back to the general store to make some room with regards to the loot that we have collected. Gimme stiff. The Robo Brain, constructor of General Atomic Blah is a unique 
bit that uses an actual organic brain as its central processor. Oh my god, that's just weird. What kind of brain is it? Is it a person's brain? Would I be locked into a side into the in the basement inside a robot's head for the rest of its days? What if I don't want to be a robot? No. Who else can I convince? No. Oh yeah, Pete was the only other one I could convince, and he's not going to come because I haven't got twenty-five explosive thingamajiggies. Never mind. One day. One day. Not that I think I'll ever have a very high explosive rate because I don't really want to. Hi. So what's going on? Yes, Sonny's with us. Well, I guess that. Let's do this. All right, I'm ready. Right. Time to look alive. The Powder Gangers are here to play. And we shall be together to fight them in the next video. But for the time being, I'm going to pause it there because we are running out of time. So thank you for joining me in my world for this playthrough. I hope to see you in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.